In this problem, we want to factor out the greatest common factor where we have a variable x raised to the uh, negative fraction exponent. So those are rational exponents. Um, so the first step is to identify um, what the greatest common factor is. So in this case, the greatest common factor is always going to be the variable. So in this case, greatest common factor equals um, so our variable is x, but to the smallest power. So from negative one-third and negative four-thirds, the smallest power is negative four-thirds. Now remember, when we're factoring out a common factor, we're reversing distributing. So in distributing, we multiply, and factoring out, we divide. So what we're going to do is divide each of these terms individually by x to the negative four-thirds. And that x to the negative four-thirds is going to come down in the result in front. And then what we'll have to do is figure out what would be left inside as a result of that action. So when we take a look at the first term, we have like bases connected with division. So when we have that situation, we keep the base, which would be x, and raise it to the power uh, by subtracting the exponent. So off to the side we have a negative one-third in the numerator minus a negative four-thirds in the denominator. So doing our arithmetic here, that'll stay negative one-third minus a negative will turn to plus four-thirds. And that'll result in three over three, which is just one. So we're going to have one x left inside minus, then we'll turn our attention to this second expression in there. And in this one, we're going to have x, and we'll do the exponent the same way, negative four-thirds minus negative four-thirds. And in calculating this, this is negative four-thirds plus a positive four-thirds, which adds to zero which means we have no x's left inside. Now, you may have noticed that whenever you divide something by itself, as long as it's not 0, they would divide and just leave a 1, which is where we'll end up. So when we clean this up, we have x to the negative 4 thirds in front. x to the first power is just x, and x to the 0 power is 1, so x minus 1. Or like I said, if you notice they were the same terms, you divide them as long as they're not 0, and you get 1. So there's our result, x to the negative 4 thirds times x minus 1.